<clears throat> What's going on, guys? Um, as you can tell, this is probably tell this is the first video on my review channel, and I am reviewing this retro mini Game Boy Advance player. Uh, manufacturer, rah, rah, rah. support play GBA games. You gotta love broken English. Barrier free connection between lattice of LCD screen and game running system. Did I really just say screen? I need to learn how to read again. Retro game console restore HD original system operation interface up to 26 languages. Yeah, you got your standard uh, buttons, your D-pad, A, B, start, select, and put, rest, start, select to quit or archive the game. Oh, was, ah, just a side note too, I got this uh, sometime last week, I think on a Wednesday got this on Wednesday last week and this was um, $40.25 from eBay in Australian money. Um, yeah, as the console will come back to that. Now this did come with a USB cord but it's at my place and besides I've got another adapter for it anyway. Um, user manual do I wanna have a look at this on video my answer is no because it doesn't wanna focus or does it come on focus thank you uh... if you wanna read this you can pause the video uh, yeah, and here's your, as I upload more videos, I will hopefully get better at these reviews, so please, Excuse the shitty quality of this. Oh, on that note as well, I'm not only filming this on my iPad, but I'm doing the whole review through the screen on my iPad, and that's probably why video quality's shite. Uh, yeah. That's pretty much it for the user manual. That's not, um, Advanced Wars or something, is it? I wouldn't have a clue. Uh... Anyway, here's the console itself. Oh, nearly saw my ugly mug. <laughs> um, yeah, this... When I took it out of the box, I'm like, holy crap. It is a lot tinier than I expected. And yes, that was a massive that's what she said moment. Um, but yeah, as you saw before, you got your A, B, start, select your d-pad and the shoulder buttons and while holding this the shoulder buttons actually feel surprisingly good um, I've got a micro SD card in there but that's one I bought separately so if you are hoping to get an SD card with it sorry you're out of luck um, yeah the speakers on it, uh, the speaker on it's surprisingly loud, but it does often um, change its loudness, uh, its volume by itself without you moving the volume wheel. Um, oh yeah, headphone jack, micro USB. All stuff you're pretty... I'm assuming you're pretty familiar with. Um, uh, 
you can play in that during games, but you got to go into the file manager to do it, which is a massive pain in the ass. But and yes, this does play NES and SNES games. Uh, now, I think that's pretty good, but there's one thing I don't like about it. About the NES games. You'll see why soon. You'll see what it is soon. I don't know if you can hear that, but... Look. The NES games have this horrible... A, B button inversion and ugh, it's awful Xbox fans would be in their element but Nintendo fans would obviously beg to differ you noticed how the volume just went quiet just now didn't you oh I wish this takes a lot of fuck. It's <laughs> it takes a lot of getting used to. Um, but yeah, like I said, Xbox fans would probably be in their element on this thing because A B yeah. Terrible inversion. Uh, and the classic NES games for GBA, they don't work either, which sucks. But you can't have everything, I guess. Now I'd play this song. Yeah, you know what, I'm just going to... No, I'm not. What? No, I don't want to copy it. Is this a save file? I want to open it. A remake slash port of one of my favourite SNES games of all time. Now you may not be able to tell on camera, but in real life there is a bit of, um, there are some frame rate issues. Ah, oh, Jesus. This may not just be a review channel either, I may decide to do other shit on here, but regardless, this is a new channel and it is not exactly recommended for little kids, so yeah. Do -do 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 -do. If you want to check out SNES games being played on this thing, um, you can probably head to this Does Not Compute channel. I'll put a link down here or wherever the hell it goes. Because I'm too lazy to put SNES ROMs on the SD card myself. But it's about time I stopped abusing this extra life system, that's what I've been doing every time i played this game, and uh, yeah, it's about time I stopped doing that, 
He only, this does not compute, he only plays Super Mario World, the SNES version, for a very brief moment. But yeah, they do play on here. Roping Rampage. And I think we might wrap up the review here. Alright, so that was the Retro Mini Portable. I hope you guys enjoyed it, which I bet you didn't, let's be honest. Um, but if you did, please leave a like, comment, and possibly subscribe. Yes, I know, I took it way too far with asking for subscribers, but some people just happen to enjoy people rambling on about electronics and shit. I'm one of those people that enjoys watching reviews about that. Um... I'll put a link to Tweeter Man's mm, Tweeter Man 287's channel as well, because he's the one who inspired me to do review videos, so massive shout out to him. Uh, yeah. So once again, welcome to my new channel. Uh, and I will see you next time.